Welcome to LMB Show and Tell for my five minute video share. Uh, as most of you, these past week and a half has been really heartbreaking. Um, what's going on around the world in Paris and Brussels. Um, and for me, uh, I have two favorite cities, uh, New York City, because I was born in New Jersey and I love New York City. And the other city, which is Paris. I've been there twice and it's a magical place and it will always have a place in my heart. And I was watching CNN nonstop, uh, every single moment I could. And I thought that it would be wrong for me to sell my Paris journals and I was going to uh, make them all inactive. And I was about to do that and then I decided that that would be wrong. Uh, I love Paris and I, I don't want to have that fear in my heart. <laughs> so I'm making this little short video uh, to just show you some of my Paris journals. Uh, that are up for sale and that I refuse to take out of my shop and I hope you love Paris as much as I do and, and maybe if you haven't been there I hope one day you will go there. The first things I'm going to show you and these have been pretty popular these are the uh, Paris journals these are my most expensive one and they're really simple but I think really fun Lots of seam binding, Paris charm, and these are the seven gypsy covers. And I love the way they look so vintage. Look at this. All this water damage, that's the way they come. And there are 25 pages that I have tea dyed and inked. And the paper I use on the front and the back changes depending upon what I have at the time. But this set that I made, I'm using the Graphic 45 and I love that the colors of it. And every single page has either a stamp or washi tape on it. So they're heavily decorated and I've got oodles and oodles of tags. Look at this. Postcards. Um, little things that I found, like this is from the, uh, the Beatles when they played there uh, many, many years ago. Uh, so you can see lots of stamps, which I really, truly, and then the last one, Amour. And then what I include with each one of these is a packet. And it includes the card and a postcard and a paper clip an act from an actual uh, Paris map that I have um, added some glitter to. The other things that I've made, um, this is a little coffee journal and this postcard is, I actually got this at the Scrapbook Expo and they, these are two gals all dressed up having their um, espresso or cappuccino and this I think is a really cute one it comes with a little coffee charm of course it's got the matching envelope gift card and a little bit of stamping and then on the back here what I did was to use an actual coffee uh, holder what is it called coffee sleeve and a couple of little charms uh, tags, I'm sorry, and a big tag with a coffee. And then the last one which I put up, this is a, again I got this at the Scrapbook Expo, and this is a copy of a French stamp. And I think it's lovely because it's winter time. So I added the snowflake and my last piece of ribbon with Je t'aime Paris and it's lined on the back also and then it includes this little Paris key. 
which has the key to my heart. And, oh, this also comes with a whole stack of ephemera, including tags. So I will continue to post, uh, list new French items that I make. I'm making a book right now, a journal. I've just tea dyed all the pages. And it's actually from a French book. And I hope you do too. So I want to wish everyone a very safe and happy Thanksgiving holiday. And keep Paris in your heart. Bye.